There's nothing like chilling with my girls Just me and my divas taking over the world What's up, Divas and Divas? So it's your girl. I'm back. I haven't recorded a hair tutorial video in like three weeks because I was away in New York, but it is always good to be home. So you guys, I am ready to record this. First of all, I'm so happy because for one, my own nails are actually growing. Like seriously, it did break off. These did break off a little bit, but you know, you know, guys, I am really not into like the nails and all of that stuff. I just ain't, but I thought, Hey, let me be a little bit more girly and you know, let my nails grow out. I'll polish them a little bit more. Maybe that'll help, you know, whatever. So you guys, I'm ready to do this video. This is for ebonylines.com. If you guys are not familiar with ebonylines.com, they are a website that just sells wigs for all who love short, long, medium, curly, straight, whatever your preference is, they do have a lot of wigs. I will post a coupon code below for you guys so that way you can save. I think it's like 10% off, but either way, I will definitely post it below. So this one is different for me because I do like the short wigs, but Sometimes I don't go with all the short wigs because I tell you guys all the time, I have like a long head, like seriously. And when I have gained weight, I cannot wear short wigs because a long head with the short wigs just don't go, especially if it's a long pudgy head. So I figured I would go back to the short wigs and try something, especially because it's so darn hot out here. So this one was recommended or this brand was recommended to me by Ebony Lime, which is Bobby Boss. I love Bobby Boss wigs, always have. They have some really nice wigs. Um, they're not my favorite brand, but they are one of the brands that I do like a lot. And lately they have been coming out with a lot of nice styles. So they are like number two on my like favorite wigs list. So this one is short and it's called Apple, okay? At first I thought this was a lace wig, but it's actually a full wig, which makes it even better because you ain't got to do nothing, but just plop this sucker on your head. So the color that I got is a 1B, just something natural because I don't really like to wear the short wigs like in colors because for some reason they just don't go. Um, for me, I just can't rock them like that. Though I would like to try something like Platinum Blonde, we'll have to see in the near future. So this one right here, Apple does have, doesn't have any combs in the front or anything like that, but there is an adjustable strap in the nape area. So you guys, you know, if you are like, you know, kind of nervous or paranoid about, you know, the wig falling off or slipping back or blowing off or being pulled off, you can definitely just use some bobby pins for the unit. I have been trying my best not to use any combs on the side of my temples because look, my edges are growing back in. Okay. So a girl is happy, happy. And like I said, because it's so hot out here, we are going to be doing something CC friendly cool and cute honeys. Now, of course, it doesn't look that great um, straight out the package because you're definitely going to have to give it some life. So I'm going to just put this net on my head because my hair is freshly washed. And So, do you see this wig? Apple. Okay, hunties, look. The back even is tapered nice, okay? 
the back looks really nicely tapered. I don't know why I like this wig so much, but I actually really, really do. It kind of reminds me of Sensational's Fab Fringe, which was my favorite when it first came out. And then it seemed like as the years went by, they changed like the cut of it a little bit. So I wasn't like the number one fan of it, but I had probably about six of them and I wore them to death. Now this one is synthetic, but the fibers, the texture is so like misleading in a good way you would not think that this was synthetic i had to look at this stock card like twice just to make sure that i wasn't bugging out because this looks like human hair like the way you can flip it and manipulate the style that you want it would really really make you believe that this is um human hair you can definitely put heat to it but i wouldn't even do that because you know once you do that you ruin the curl pattern and they're so inexpensive that you could just go out and get you a couple more of these what? this no. one is like super cute like and i like when they're synthetic like this because then you don't have to get up and curl it you ain't got to do nothing honey but just do this you could put you some of this aussie insta freeze like girl okay but either way this wig is like bomb girl definitely check out ebony line let me know what you think of this one right here i feel like i'm getting my little mojo back you know it seems like when you take a break for a while from just recording you have to really get in the mood to do it so i wasn't really even gonna do videos today i was like i don't feel like it but then i was like you know what just go ahead and do a couple and see how it works out for you so i'm glad that this was the first one that i reviewed for my comeback because listen I'm about to go and edit the video for this as soon as I get finished with a couple more. And this is going to be the Monday upload. Okay. So on that note, you guys, I love you all. Stay diva and divalicious. Make sure you make rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs this video up, share it with your friends and family on social media. Let me know what you think. Tell me you love me as much as I love you guys. All the info for Ebony Line, which is the Bobby Boss Apple full wig, will be posted for you guys down below. And the color that I do have is a 1B. I love you guys. Stay diva and divalicious. And I'll see you guys on the soon to come. Bye.